Progress blog here, www.progressblog.blogspot.com. Um, this weekend, uh, Luke Harper, Brody Lee, passed away. He was the leader of the Dark Order in AEW, and now the unit is in a weird situation where they're the heel unit, but they no longer have their leader. Now, 30 to 40 years ago, if uh, the leader of a major heel stable had passed away for some reason, the fans would have cheered it. Really, they would. Um, and there were actually some instances where that did happen. Um, but that's obviously not going to happen today where everyone knows that wrestling isn't real and, you know, where people are uh, generally not like that anymore. I think AEW is kind of stuck no matter what they do here. Um you know, uh, I think, like, the best ideas they're probably not going to do and some of the worst ideas they might. Um, the way I see it is that there's four real options here. Um, the first option is if they turn them face, which I think they're likely going to do here. Um, the problem is, though, if you do that, I don't know where they really go with it. Because um, the Dark Order is obviously going to be getting cheered for at least the meantime until this situation cools off. But what do you do with them? I mean, the only other heel stable there really is to fight is uh, the Inner Circle. Or if they can uh, try to get something going with Kingston, um, the Butcher, and the Blade, and maybe someone else. Um, but, I mean, is that does that really excite anyone? You know, I mean, you know, even if you do that, like, how do you really get there? You know, how do you get people to care? And... The worst part is that because, you know, the situation, it really has to be done, like, you really have to be careful about how you do it. So, you know, I mean, someone like the Inner Circle would have to come up with a reason to hate the Dark Order now, and they'd have to be able to do it in a classy way that has nothing to do with Brody. And I don't really know how you get to that. Um, you know, uh, so, so, I mean, I, I think that's one of the big problems with that idea, and long term i mean say, say you do do that where do you go from there after that you know like if we're three months down the line and the dark order is still a face stable where do you go with that you know what i mean what, what's the plan um you know it doesn't seem like there is a plan and you know i i don't know if that's really the best idea um you know i mean if if they would have like a brody lee cup or something like that Maybe they could have the Dark Order win it for him, you know, and do something like that. Um, but, I, again, all I see with a face turn is short-term stuff. I, I don't see anything long-term with it. Now, another idea is that they could keep the Dark Order heel. Um, wow, this is obviously not going to work in the short term, because that crowd's going to cheer the Dark Order no matter what, at least until the situation cools off. There's a lot more creatively that you could do with it. Um... Someone online, and this wasn't exactly my original idea, but someone online had suggested that they turn more into like a cult, like a North Korean type of cult, and, you know, over their leader, Kim Jong-un. Um, you know, if, if if you've ever seen pictures from that or videos, it's like all these people love this guy. They put his picture on everything. They, you know, they're willing to do whatever for him. Something like that would be really interesting. But um, to do that, you kind of risk offending someone, and you risk being in poor taste, and... I don't know. That's I think that's a little bit too edgy and too gutsy for something like AEW. I, I just don't see that happening, even though I think creatively it would make it a really interesting stable. You know, and it makes sense. I mean, everyone in the Dark Order loves that guy, you know. So, you know, of course they'd be sad about it. About it. And they're already in a weird kind of cult stable anyway. So, I mean, it's, it seems plausible. But um, I don't really think that'll be what happens. You could also go another route here, and you could keep him heel, but um, you could maybe have the group dissolve into chaos without their leader. I think that'd be interesting. Maybe they could start losing matches, they could start arguing, you know, um, and then the eventual end to this would, I think, keep in mind what they've been trying to do anyway, is you would have Adam Page be the one who clears everything up, solves all the problems, and gets them all united as one. And then, what you could do is that you could um, turn them into, like, a different kind of stable. You could re-gimmick it. You know, maybe it wouldn't be the Dark Order anymore. You know, maybe it would be something cowboy-themed or just something that would fit Paige a little bit better. And then you could still do whatever it seems like they're doing with Paige here. You could keep him heel, and things wouldn't really change that much. Um, but um, I just don't know if that's going to happen because in the short term... We know the Dark Order is going to be getting cheered, so that's going to make a lot of that hard. 
And I also think that you could, um, you know, if it's done wrong, I think it would offend some people. So that also wouldn't be very good, which would be another problem with that. You could um, also re-gimmick them into this, a different stable, and that's kind of like what I was talking about with that last idea. Um, you know, that might be another way to do it. Um, the last idea is the idea I've always had. I, I've never liked the stable, personally. I've never seen any money in it. I don't see the appeal. I don't think it has drawn anything, and I don't really think it has helped anyone, and I'd be cool with dissolving it, because I think that's overall where this goes anyway, unless it stays heel and Paige takes it over. You know, I mean, it's just, you know, they lost through later. The stable was never good, in my opinion. I don't think it's drawn anything, and just dissolving it, while it, it will hurt in the short term, and believe me, it will, because, you know, they're going to have to reroute a whole lot of storylines, but I think it's better for the overall good, because I, I truly think this stable has sucked, and they've wasted over a year of TV time. It really hasn't gone anywhere or accomplished anything, you know, and for me, the sooner we get rid of that, the better. But I don't think we're going that way. So, um, from what we can tell so far, it seems like they're going to turn face, and, you know, as I said, I don't know where that's going to go in the long term, but at least that seems like the idea for now. So, we'll uh, see what happens. Uh, what do you guys think? You guys have any good ideas? Um, and then, uh, you know, you can leave a comment and we'll uh, talk about that one in the comment section. But, uh, thank you for listening, everyone. Uh, Pro Rest Blog here, uh, prorestblog.blogspot.com. Come and check it out. Lots of good, uh, picks and gifs. Thank you.